Today on Jer and Jeff Eat New West, it's day five of the El Santo takeover. We're learning how to caramelize onions. So we learned how to slice and cut onions, now we're gonna learn how to caramelize them. So we've taken the onions that we've cut in a previous video and we're going to just cook them slow for a long time and caramelize them. What you're gonna need, you're gonna need a pot that'll fit the amount of onions that you wanna have. Keep in mind the onions are gonna shrink by about two thirds. So whatever pot needs to be big enough to hold it all, but also it'll shrink a lot. So if you need to move it to something smaller at some point, that's fine. So when I caramelize onions, I like to start in a cold pot with no oil and just the onions. You put the, all of the onions in, you cover them with salt and you cover the pot and leave it at a low heat. What that's gonna do is it's gonna let the onions start to release their moisture and it's gonna let them start to slowly cook. If you start onions with a very high heat and you start to caramelize them that way, you're gonna get a lot of really nice color but the onions aren't gonna cook all the way through and they're not gonna release their moisture. So when the onions don't cook through, you get as they sit, they'll start to get a little bit more bitter and you really don't want that. The whole point of caramelizing the onions is to bring out the sugars, bring out the sweetness. So we're gonna let them cook slowly. It'll take probably about 10, 15 minutes of cooking before you get them to a translucent stage. You can see now that they've pretty much cooked. You're getting a little bit of color from the bottom, but not a lot. Once you get to that point, we'll take the lid off and we'll increase the heat. And now we're looking for that caramelization of those sugars. We're gonna cook all of that moisture out. We're gonna caramelize all that sugar, constantly stirring these onions so that they cook evenly. And once you get a nice golden brown, then they're caramelized, they're done, they're perfect, and you're not gonna get a lot of moisture in the bottom, you're not gonna get that bitterness because we let it all take its time and we let it go slow. And that is how we caramelize onions. Thanks for watching the video. And just a reminder that El Santo is accepting donations of underwear and socks or canned goods until December 20th for their food drive. You can drop those off at the restaurant El Santo or at the River Market. Next up, we've got how to make salad dressing from scratch.